This shit's okay. You know, and it'll uh, hydrate you. But it ain't got shit on my lows. Not nothing on it, you know? And it's kind of weird because my lows, right? You got my highs and my lows. We're not talking about speakers and we're not talking about, uh, you know what I mean, uppers or downers. We're talking about, you know, periods of your life, your highs and your lows or emotional states. But, you know, Gold Peak T sounds pretty good, you would think, from a marketing standpoint, you know? And my lows versus Gold Peak. You know, you got the peak, the top, the apex, the pinnacle, the climax, you know, for the ladies out there. You know, but, uh, hit me up. But, uh, my lows, my lows is way better. The simple design of their label, how much cheaper it must be than all that shit. What is that? A little seal. It's from them. It says Homebird Taste, Gold Peak. A, a seal or you know something like that endorsement means nothing if it comes from the company the same product that it's on I mean really of course you give it that it's your product stop Milo's is where it's at and I'm just making this video to say if you're out there Milo's whoever you are uh you know could you boy up with like a lifetime supply of Milo's tea or something. I will let you paint my whole vehicle decked out Milo's if y'all are into that type of shit. And, you know, ride around in it every day. Looking good as fuck. And, uh, you know, doing big things which people will be like, damn, you know, I want to be like that guy in the Milo's vehicle. You know? Because uh, I believe I'm in my low point right now, you know. But the crazy, you know, ironic thing, y'all, this is uh, the guy in the Milo's car is at his gold peak right now. You feel me? So, uh, I know they don't like that shit, but I don't give a fuck. Because make some better tea. I mean, this is some Yankee fucking tea, dude. Like, for real. You know? You ain't gonna go in no motherfucking southern woman's kitchen in her fridge and get some tea, some sweet tea, and it tastes like that. I hope not, at least. You know? I would rather have unsweet tea than that. Real shit. It tastes like a damn Arnold Palmer you know, made by a blind person after an earthquake, so all their condiments and uh, sugars and stuff like that are all bounced around in the pantry and they didn't know there was an earthquake.